It's an important tool as it relates to recovery, recuperation, and all that. And there is a group, an art group. They meet every Tuesday at the Office of Cancer Support Services. And there, they create art. In the initial stages, they're dabbled. But now they can perhaps be considered as artists. And only recently an exhibition was staged. So you can't stage an exhibition unless you're an artist, correct? Correct. So we thought it was necessary to present you, the presenters, a memento of the pieces that have been created. And I trust that it will serve as a memory of your time spent with us, a memory of your holiday, your time in Barbados. I said holiday, but you'll come back for a holiday. <laughs> and of course, a memory of the relationship that has been formed between yourselves and Cancer Support Services. So, as I call you, Madam President will offer the presentations. Dr. Tanya Trippett, could you please come forward? <laughs> we recognize Parent Hazel Ford And we are so glad that you joined us today And that you shared with us your experience Ashley Munchell. <laughs> Doctor Sheila Whiteman. You'd realize that Kathy likes the hug, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we give hugs that can't support. Dr. Kirk Bodkin. presenters, Dr. Emmanuel and Dr. Alexis, they had to leave, but of course they received their data. But we also want to show our kind appreciation to our moderators. If you were watching the CPL games and you took note of Pollard, the captain of the Barbados Trident, you would recognize his movements among the, the wicked. He's fast, he's quick, he's making it happen. And as I watched Dr. Chaturani and Dr. Cave, I said, they're probably playing for the trident. Thank you. <laughs> Fast and to the point. And we thank you for readily accepting. We thank you for accepting to do this because we needed someone obviously with the background, but more importantly, someone who can carry it with the charm and the aplomb which you have done. And we thank both you, Dr. Chaturani and Dr. Cave. And now, Dr. Chaturani, and in your program, you'd realize that the other moderator was scheduled to be Ian Lewis, but unfortunately, he couldn't be here. And Dr. Cave said, yes, I'll come, I'll do it, I'll be here. And we thank you also. Thank you very much. In my expression of thanks, 
permit me to take it to the very beginning and recognize the dear friend of Cancer Support Services, Reverend Paul Leacock, who in his own way brought the invocation, setting the tone for our day's experience. Our President Kathy Ann Kelly Springer, she, is, she has been elected as president for just about two months now? Just about? Let's say two months. All right. But I know for her this is a learning experience. This is of course her first conference in that capacity. And so she brought you a welcome that is very synonymous with the feelings of Cancer Support Services. And we are pleased that you were able to join us and thank you for your kind words of welcome. I made mention of the relationship between the charity and government and we, in his absence, we certainly want to thank the Honorable John Boyce. There is a Swahili quotation which says, where there are experts, there will be no lack of learners. And today, 